Hello and welcome to the Stephen Trice Podcast, Series 2, Episode 4. Hey! Ooh. Four. <laughs> Today I'm joined by David Rees. Hello there. Oh, oh, I didn't actually mean to do that. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> oh, bro. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> I didn't actually mean to do that. Clean slate, we said, didn't we, Dave? Out. Clean slate. Start again. Last week was Ahoy. <laughs> it's a, Next week you're just going to blank. <laughs> Tom? I'll, I'll say... Um, <sighs> Top top of the morning. Yeah. Doesn't sit right with me. Uh, I don't fair what you did. Then. Cultural yeah. appropriation. Yeah. <laughs> um, hello. Nailed it. Yeah. Uh, Max Smith. Hello there. <laughs> the one, the only, the original. <laughs> Intro. I'm, not, I'm not sure you are the first to say that, mate. Uh, Isn't it from Star Wars? <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll never tell. What's, what's your name, David? See what I did there? Because uh, he stole something. What, my dad's name? Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we Dad, saw what you fucking Your dad's did. got a cool name. Thanks, mate. And Tom Looney. Yeah, uh, thank you. Hey. Great, to be here. <laughs> Great to be here on the Stephen Trice podcast. And Joe McGrath's over in the corner, having a cheeky pocket wank. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel like you've gone done that one before. <laughs> Joe probably has, though, you know. I base these all on the truth. Mm. You say Nothing? what you say. Yeah, absolutely. That's it. It's like catchphrase. <laughs> For any viewers at home, you can see I've got blue sunglasses on and a blue hat because I've got a blue tick on Twitter now. Yeah. Hey. Big deal, mate. Big deal. Hey. No, it's white for me because I've got the black background, so uh. well, that's the whole thing. Um. That's incredible, though. You've worked really Thanks, hard mate. for this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah congrats. A lot, um, yeah. lot of tweets along the way. Les Dennis blocked me. That was yep. a tough few oh. months. Yeah. I bet, I bet. Fuck you, Les. Fuck you. Who else has blocked me? Someone <laughs> else? Oh, James Charles. Oh, yeah, of James course. Wow. Yeah. James Charles and Les Dennis oh. are they a couple now <laughs> oh. they have never been seen in the same room <laughs> don't take the blue tick away please <laughs> dear god <laughs> whilst we're on the topic of me <laughs> me <laughs> cheers guys the new channel Stephen Dry Shorts wow. uh, had a long live life um <laughs> I thought it'd be funny to make a joke about trying on shorts instead of posting short videos. It over to Wingate. <laughs> 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 That's all I hear. And, uh, <laughs> and not the Franco. So. Bleep that. We can't have publicity. Bleep <laughs> 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 that. Out. <laughs> 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 oh, that was uh, yeah, I've, uh, I've given that in, so you can you yeah, can yeah, you can overtake yeah, that. Yeah. And lastly, whilst we're on business involving myself. Uh, we're pushing here real hard for the 100k special. So if we get to 100,000 subscribers, you have got, I don't feel it now. No, no, I'm a surprise. A 24 hour special coming your way. That's right. That's right. 24 hours of this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're going to take our, our usual one hour, 10 minute podcast and stretch it out, baby. Stretch it's it possible. out. It's possible. <laughs> Three hour IMAX, baby. Yeah, yeah. It's coming hot and it's coming fast. No, no, no. Dear God. <laughs> took two me eight weeks to prepare. <laughs> <laughs> Too short. All right, we can go higher. Okay. Oh. I imagine Whoopi Goldberg would want some sort of like, oh, money from her, that. Her yeah. lawyers have been in contact. <laughs> <laughs> all, the, all the money from it goes to charity. Yeah. Uh, so we're not sure which charity yet because. Some of them are shit. Yeah. Boring. <laughs> <laughs> we want to find a cool charity. You know? <laughs> one, that, one all the popular kids donate to. Boy Scouts of America. <laughs> no, not of America. Just general Boy Scouts. Yeah. Let's yeah. not be racist here. General Boy Scouts. Or Tom. women Scouts. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Have you ever scouted women? <laughs> <laughs> the women Scouts. <laughs> Now I guess I have to ask about your lives. Dave, what you been up to? Uh, quite a bit this week. Yeah. Um, done a um, few nice, went on a few nice walks um, around, uh, I'm not going to say where, in case people come looking for me. Oh, so, Dave. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, I've uh, got a hit list on me, you see. It's, uh, have you? Yeah, yeah. Why's uh, on a hit list and come here, you know? Oh. <laughs> Better be this close. <laughs> Especially uh, with Hitman McGrath over there. <laughs> Max, what have you been up to? Picture the scene, guys. Uh, I'm in my bed. Ding dong. Oh, is that the doorbell? It sure was. Uh, I opened the door, but the guy's driven off. Oh, bloody hell. Uh, so I look at my emails. <laughs> you live right by the front door. Right? <laughs> Your room is next to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's too quick for you. Yeah, too quick. Too yeah, yeah. speedy. Uh, so I get there. Obviously, he's gone. Were you ah. naked? Were you naked? Were no, you? not fully 
Not fully not naked. fully naked. <laughs> the top half of my body was clothed, <laughs> sir. Um, I had a hat on. <laughs> <laughs> Which, really enough, covered up my penis. <laughs> um, Dickhead. <laughs> uh, so, because of that, I had to go to the post office. Uh, right, okay. Which, let me say, it's a dying industry. Yeah? <laughs> yeah? Post, posties, you know. We're talking about blockbusters. Gone. Remember Threshers? Oh, yeah. yeah. Threshers wine. There's still so many alcoholics in the in the UK, you know, you'd think that would be going well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what the issue is, is these big, you know, supermarkets, you can get what, Crofter cider for £2? <laughs> <laughs> is well, Cactus Jack still a thing? Is that still definitely a is, yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Frosty, Frosty Jacks, Jacks yeah, yeah, yeah. White Lightning. Yeah. White All ice. drinks used to drink yeah. in a park. These are park drinks. So yeah. Kestrel Lager. Chateauneuf to Pup. <laughs> 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 Uh, so the post office was it busy it was me and the guy that worked there oh the sexual tension man. <laughs> I trust I've, I've got a package no, for you yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. first class <laughs> well <laughs> no, first. take a few days to come <laughs> nice yeah man yours made sense mine didn't mine did you say <laughs> you got to spit on it first <laughs> you'll, you'll need sell the day <laughs> and what have you <laughs> yours was clever mine was just <laughs> don't forget your stamps <laughs> I'm going to put a finger in your ass. <laughs> right here. <yeah>. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think you fill in the gaps there. <laughs> Tom, yeah, speaking yeah. of finger in the ass, what have you been up to? Uh, not much, David. Not much. Uh, I did get an Amazon delivery. Oh. What was inside? Uh, some Omega 3 uh, tablets. Boring. Nice. Omega. Yeah. Yeah. It's like um, the Greek sign, isn't it? It's true, yeah. Yeah. Dave was in a frat, everyone. Yeah, yeah. We <laughs> used to beat up the... The Omega-3. <laughs> <laughs> Stank of fish oil. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm not going to their house party. <laughs> so it's free wet wipes we again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Trying to get in a fucking party. <laughs> we used to hunt out fishermen. Oh, yeah, right. man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Obviously, uh, <laughs> everyone uh, seems to think that I just kind of played it off last week and that I did really get my ass wiped by Devon. <laughs> mm. uh, can I point out... That did not happen because you both told me that you thought I was lying and it did Yeah, happen. we were convinced it, uh, it, definitely <laughs> did. it definitely did not happen. Um, the fact you brought it up again to, to, to doubt Well, play. no, because I, thought it, because I thought it was fine. Oh, you know, everyone's having a laugh. But then apparently you two, after I left, were like, yeah, it definitely happened. <laughs> no shame in that. No, no shame. No, there's no that. shame. There's no shame. I had my bum wiped when I was I just, a baby. Yeah. <laughs> I just love the truth, you know. Yeah. So I didn't, yeah. Ever been that drunk? Well, I've been in your boots. What? No, no, no one's wiped my ass. Dave, <laughs> you just sat in it, did you? I did. No, yeah. oh. if it's, uh, I'll just let it mellow. It'll uh, clear wow. itself. I don't think mellow has ever been used for <laughs> <laughs> shitting yourself. Yeah. Oh, is that one of those just mellows that again? There. Feeling yeah. proper mellow. Yeah. It's, um, it's like the co word you'd say if there's people around. Is that a mellow? <laughs> <laughs> it'll come off in the bath. That's what I think. Yeah, it definitely will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but then it'll stay there in the yeah, bath. Yeah. I don't know if you haven't even have to pull the plug. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Max, I can't believe we haven't mentioned this. New t-shirt. Polo New shirt even. t-shirt, baby. Lovely colour. Thank you. For listeners, listeners, uh, it's a navy blue? Yeah. What's the story behind it? Uh, my girlfriend got it for me. Oh. She said it's got stripes like my jumper. Nice. So, you know. But it's, it's different. More discreet. It? It's different. Uh, every stripe's different. Yeah. That's so it's true. a polo shirt. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, it's a beautiful shirt, you know. For the uh, listeners. If, well, okay. if uh, you know, obviously I wouldn't want to take over Stephen Troy's shorts, but maybe I could do a shirt <laughs> review one Absolutely. day. Absolutely, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I'd, I'd love to work on the channel. That's uh, you know. We've got a long <laughs> list of people. KSI has been jabbering at me. <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't be surprised. No. No. Uh, not the Francos have been asking. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> I don't think I want to post on that channel. <laughs> yeah, if it's not broke, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Winged's coming across as desperate. Oh. <laughs> Slagging off a podcast. Yay! Yay! This week we're taking on the idiots that have a podcast called "There's No Such Thing as a Fish." That's oh. ridiculous. Oh. Clearly Foolish, fish exists. mate. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Just talking about it. I think there's over at least 20 fish in the world. Mm. So you're not wrong. Finding Nemo. Ever yeah. seen that? Yeah. That's about a fish. Never seen it. We we base our podcasts on facts. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. They might have a young, vulnerable audience, and they're lying to them. 
Do you know what? The other week I was at the park, right? Doing some keepy uppies uh, <laughs> over by the uh, football pitch. Yeah. A little kid runs up to me and he goes, Hey up, lad. There's no such thing as fish. Yeah. Like, you <laughs> fucking idiot. I booted him in the head. <laughs> that doesn't make us look good. <laughs> Took him to shop. Yeah, we <laughs> Showed him all the tuna cans and I went, what the fuck is this then? We have no moral high ground, mate. <laughs> I just started lobbing tin cans of tuna at his face. Yeah, the Stephen Trice podcast boys, protectors of the truth. <laughs> Yes. Real, real heroes. Engage. Well done, Max. Yeah, yeah thank yeah. you. Yeah. But that just shows other people if if they go and you know spit in lies like that, exactly. they'll be pelted by people you know, like me. Fishy tins will believe it, and I'll get all confused when I'm eating a tuna sandwich. Yeah. yeah. Like, what's yeah. this? A horse, especially from Tesco. Exactly. Bringing it back. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Love that. Anyway, the news. So much has gone on this week. Oh. Golden Globes. Yes. We were nominated. Mm, so I thought Stephen tried to short to scoop a few <laughs> things there. Uh, Harry and Meghan are doing their Oprah interview. It, it would have been out by now, mm. but uh, it would have been yesterday. Are but they interviewing her? Yeah. No, she's interviewing them. Right. Uh, she hates being questioned as Oprah. <laughs> but it's... Um, what I heard was, my sister told me a theory about this, and apparently uh, the, the interview comes out Sunday. And she's mm. like, have you heard the, the rumour that the royal family are going to announce uh, was it Prince Philip he's going to be dead on Saturday they're, like, they're going to announce his death <laughs> to take all I the don't shine want to away. Do it. I don't want to do it Elizabeth <laughs> <laughs> we need to be on trend in- <laughs> 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 they've got Oprah <laughs> we could just do a giveaway <laughs> <laughs> too late Prince Phil you're gone <laughs> Lady Gaga's dog was stolen oh, oh yeah Songs, well dogs two yeah, of them two. and bloke was shot yeah, yeah. Oh, the, the, the walker. Dog walker. Yeah, yeah. yeah. God. Uh, she's done the nice thing though. She's paid for his hospital bills, uh, so they say. Yeah, the, the half a million for the dog's reward, and she's just paid the guy's hospital bills. Mm. Has he not got any more money? Surely there should be some sort of hazard pay. Yeah, yeah. Like, I mean, let's not speculate as to what she hasn't done for this guy. I'm sure yeah. she's looked after him. Yeah. She would be paying in the minimum wage for a dog walker. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure it's yeah. Yeah. Mind you, she could just say, "Well, you did lose him." That's true. Did get shot. She could say that. Dave. She could say that. Did lose him. <laughs> <laughs> so you ain't getting no more off me. <laughs> but that's a bit like that story of you with that kid. You know, you don't come off looking good. <laughs> Surprisingly. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, if, if my dogs were stolen, I wouldn't offer half a million. No. You wouldn't offer it. Keep them. <laughs> <laughs> do, you need, do you need dog food? I've got loads of it in the cupboard now. Do you need more condoms, Joe? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh god that was really good news oh I, I think we're missing something though Ooh. what could that be Max headline <laughs> news got a, got a jingle got a jingle uh, if you can tell me the Lucas, then I'll be quite surprised to be honest thank you to Santan Dave and Burner Boy for that <laughs> sweet sweet tune big up Statman Dave Santan hey, Sant. uh, so today the headline different people, is different interests Severed human feet keep washing up on shores, but police insist Fucking there's hell. nothing weird about it. Was this the next article after last week's? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> police insist it's just a mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> I subscribe to a very specific magazine. <laughs> yeah, so there's a beach somewhere. Yeah. So obviously it's a place with a beach. Um in 1887, there was one shoe in a boot that washed up on shore, which uh, this area then uh, was called Leggin Boot Square. Right. Oh. But then, in 2007, it started again, and there's been 21 that have washed up on shore since in then. In the same place? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Where's ISIS located? Because they like getting rid of people's limbs, don't they? So I'm thinking... I love it. So it's feet that are in, like, boots. In boots, you? trainers, okay. you know, all, so, all sorts of footwear. I'm going to go Italy. Oh. Nice. <laughs> the iron ISIS doesn't sound for Italy. <laughs> this is really difficult. I'm going to go for Russia. Okay. All right, big, fast. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Chile. Got a big coast. Oh, so, uh, it's, it's Vancouver in Canada. Ah. Oh. Oh. So apparently the reason the police say it's nothing to worry about is because it's people that have died in the sea, just like of natural causes or whatever. And the because just of old the, age in the sea. <laughs> <laughs> because of the weight of the shoe, 
it uh, corrodes the bone there. So like yeah. if in the waves, the, the shoe sort of right. snaps the feet off. Right. And that's why it washes up on the shore. Oh. Yeah, it's a little bit of science there for you as well. So if you ever find a boot with a sh- uh, foot inside... Yeah, don't but don't just assume that it's nothing to worry about. Don't, yeah. don't, don't <laughs> worry about it. Definitely contact someone. Um, <laughs> just get on your like, Garfield phone. Yeah. <laughs> Take it home, play with it. Yeah. <laughs> in, in any case, new shoe. Yeah. yeah. I lost my left one the other yeah. day. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> uh, guys, oh. you've asked for it. It's back. It's reliable source. Oh, gone early with this yeah. one. Oh, is it jingle? No, oh, ju- fucking hell. Oh, no, don't oh, don't trivialise this segment. Uh, I feel bad now. This week, mustard. Nice. Uh, American mustard, yes. Fuck me. It's a one word segment. Uh, yeah, the older I get, yeah. yeah. Fun fact about mustard. Um, Shut the fuck up. Never mind. Not for me. Yeah. <laughs> I get three words. <laughs> uh, that was reliable source everyone really not a good segment this week really you 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 I was just, think on really for listeners at home I pointed at Dave Tom and Joe I was voice. spared because I said nice which is one word mm. that's so mm. true yeah mm. what was your fun fact Dave uh, too my, late uh, <laughs> boring <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah yeah now we have an ad read from Manscaped uh, they're back baby and bigger than ever. This one has the title of Spring Break. You, you in the uh, Omega 3 boys. <laughs> Loving that, yeah. <laughs> COVID Spring Break is right around the corner. And you know what that means? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> spring Break in your pants. <laughs> Manscaped is here to ensure that the party in your pants never stops. <laughs> you sure this wasn't for Stephen Dry Shorts? <laughs> <laughs> Even Veronica Corningstone wouldn't say no to this party. Uh, Anchorman, yeah. My like wankerman, yeah. Yeah. With, with, Same area. with no pubes because I use Manscaped not because I'm underage <laughs> for everyone preparing for a pants party this spring break I have an exclusive 20% off discount use code Stephen S-T-A-P-H-E-N huh? yep at manscaped.com I got the Manscaped package and they sent t-shirts oh nice oh. now these are actually the comfiest t-shirts I've ever had no, I don't know if they're selling them I should have looked into that but uh, thank you Manscaped for that Tom, uh, I've seen you wearing the boxers. Don't ask where and when, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> are they comfy? They're a bit snug. Uh, they're nice material, nice boxes. When they large, um, silky. Yeah, but I think I need an. Oh, big mm. cock! Mm. Oh, oh, big cock! Let's tuck it in every time. <laughs> yeah, good boxers though. Yeah, thank you, Manscaped. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you've done. Fat dog. <laughs> I like the light. The torch on the, the torch uh, on yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that is yeah. handy. All right, if I'm in the dark, electric's gone out. In the dark. You need to shave your testes. <laughs> yeah. Only thing I can do, get a phone or not. Yeah, now you can film it. Exactly. That's exactly. just using yeah. a torch. <laughs> Manscaped is dedicated to helping you level up your full body grooming game. Ooh. The Perfect Package 3.0 kit comes with the essential lawnmower 3.0, waterproof, good. Do it in the shower if you exactly. want. Exactly. Cordless body trimmer and a ton of other liquid formulations to round out your grooming routine. This is the best trimmer on the market for those of you in need of a chest or ball shave. Or both. Let's not limit it to one. Uh, The third generation trimmer features a cutting edge ceramic blade to reduce grooming accidents thanks to advanced skin safe technology. Pioneered. (laughs) Pioneered by Manscaped. You can also adjust settings to get a length you like. <laughs> oh, oh, just the pubes, though, yeah. Oh, <laughs> There's no extender. Oh, <laughs> I wish. <laughs> <laughs> and you can stay on top of it with almost no effort at all. Yeah. Oh, oh nice. good, yeah. <laughs> Laid back on spring break yeah. on a beach in Ma- Mexico. Oh, sipping on an, a martini. Yeah, yeah and mm. just trimming your pubes. Yeah. Laid yeah. back yeah. fun. Got me Kindle. Got me Manscaped. <laughs> Trim it. Going for the Brazilian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's a term. Other nationalities are Is that available. how they're promoting this? Something to do whilst on spring break? <laughs> I may have taken it rogue there. Yeah, yeah. Be sure to use their crop cleanser body wash to keep your hair and skin feel healthy and fresh. Because a fresh peen is what wants to be seen. It's exactly. Yeah. 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 They didn't write that. I should probably read what they put. <laughs> for a limited time, subscribers get two free gifts. Oh. The shed travel bag and the reduced chafing manscape boxes. I should use those because I chafe yeah. quite a lot. Yeah. Same. Same. Get oh, is that what they do? Oh, yeah, but I've got yeah, sexy yeah. thighs, as everyone says on Stephen Tries shorts. Chafe anyway. 
Get 20% off and free shipping with code Stephen at manscaped.com. Do yourself a favour and always use the right tools for the job. Yeah. <laughs> what job's that? What job's that? Wow. Talking point this week is biggest regrets. <laughs> I bet I can guess Manscaped. <laughs> uh, so regrets, guys. We've all got them. Mm. Mm. Unless we don't. No. Unless we've lived a perfect life. Should we get into them? Let's just have... Let's just start off with the biggest, I guess. The biggest yeah. regret. Dave, I'm going to come to you, mate. Uh, biggest regret, one I can think of straight away, is uh, James took me to this uh, party where we can go pick up this girl. and uh, For him to pick up, for sorry. For him to pick up this no. girl. In a car. In a, no, 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 just uh, like go... Was it uh, his mum? Like, no, no, no. <laughs> he says. Uh, no, like, you know, where you go, oh, hello, love. Oh, so she didn't know she was getting picked up. You fancy a kiss, yeah. Um, no. So he went there to do that, and I went with him as a support oh. pal. Uh, be like his wingman Creepy. sort of thing mm. and then uh, weird thing to do to your mum as well went, went there and they're just the most weirdest people I've ever seen what? Like, this is what James Ormond was after yeah yeah like <laughs> there was a woman a woman or a man I couldn't tell you uh, she had like a you know the because he doesn't want to assume by exactly, the way exactly no mm. nothing sexuality uh, you know like the uh, ball rat thing she's wearing one a of man them or he was wearing one of them yeah yeah well right. I think you would be able to tell in that <laughs> I, I was focused, try focusing not to look. I couldn't tell you what it was. Mm. And then uh, I was like, right, I'll get me out of here. I was, it was a regret accepting to go to the party. <sighs> yeah. I would have thought not learning to read would have been yours. <laughs> 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 go to a fucking party, Dave. <laughs> well, yeah, that's another regret. Not going to a farm for a school. Yeah. So. But yeah. you know, it shaped you. It did, it did. Made me the man I am today. <laughs> And yeah, also, you're it. handy on a farm. Exactly, exactly. I know where to put shit. <laughs> Back in the ass. <laughs> yeah. I get a fucking message. They'll delve it out sometime. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Um, exactly. Yeah. Well, the bar is pretty high. <laughs> so, Tom, <laughs> Tom, you've lived a few more years than Dave. Yeah, yeah. Done anything regrettable? So many regrets <laughs> over the years. The thing is, though, like, one of my big regrets um, was kind of around, like, I, I coasted a lot in school. Yeah, and so I kind of messed up around the time my A levels a bit. When uh, the going gets tough, yeah. And but tough you know, I wouldn't be sat here today um, if That's I'd it, yeah. taken a different path. So exactly. I guess I try and well, along maybe the way, you would have been sat in that seat. Yeah, <laughs> who wants to? Sit God there? forbid. <laughs> Joe does. Hey. Joe loves it. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know, Stephen. It's a difficult one because uh, no, no major regrets that I think I wish that had been different mm. because yeah. things that I think I could have done better. I wish I'd you know. Yeah, it's kind of taken me on this path, and you know, I'm, so I'm happy with where I am today. Yeah. What about you, Smith? Probably buying 20 burgers from McDonald's <laughs> like every day for a week. Yeah, a KFC bargain buckets, the subways. Was this for a video? No, well, I was watching videos while I was doing it. <laughs> so, that's it. technically, uh, I'm buying these to watch, watch a movie with. Um, so, things like that, you know, yeah. eating and the. Yeah. You know all the other addictions that mm. this uh, has been passed down to me genetically. You know, so true. Yeah. Is you smoking uh, a, a regret? Well, that's part of it. Yeah. Is that is that passed down genetically? No, because you didn't if, smoke when we met. Thing is, yeah. if not, then who have I got to blame but myself? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you didn't have any of these addictions until <laughs> you met me, Max. <laughs> yeah. No, I think yeah, things like that. You know, yeah. I actually quit. You know, once and then yeah. I came back and I was like. Oh, Ooh, a quitter. Ooh, Ooh, no one likes one of them, mate. That's what I said to myself. I looked at myself in the mirror and said, I can't keep doing this. This goes against my true nature. You're letting yourself down. Exactly. Yeah. So I went out and smoked 20. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Smoked the whole car. I ate 20 yeah. cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, I, I think, you know, re- realistically, yeah. it's yeah. letting my demons get the better of me. Mm-hmm. Well. Fuck off! What about you? Oh, no. You fucking kidding? Oh. I've just said. I've just said about my oh, demons. Tom. I'm fucking Sorry. lanky <laughs> over here. We're not all doing say what you see. <laughs> heavy subject matter. It's heavy, yeah. it's a heavy thought. Bro. Re- regrets isn't gonna. You know, we've had <laughs> fucking go into a party. What did you do, one, Stephen? Yeah, yeah. My biggest one, uh, probably my, my confidence at school. I was quite scared of of mm. being bullied, <laughs> <laughs> so I uh, just you know, blended in. Exercising at a younger age. Wish I'd done that. Yeah, because I was about sixteen when I started exercising, but I should have just, you know, ran around. I could have been a badminton player. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I'd started playing football earlier. Started late. What age did you do? Oh, it must have been. I think I was like year seven. I joined my first team. God. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah that's early. Yeah. yeah. I regret Sweet. giving up trampolining. That was that was good. That was good last. Yeah. Good yeah. Vibes. Did you? Yeah. Where'd you do that? Uh, a place called Swale. Um, it's, uh, it's like a swallow. Oh, swallows. Was it a club? <laughs> was it a club? Yeah, yeah. You like a swimming pool. You go do gym membership. Swallows. Swallows. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Taking the boy down to swallows. <laughs> 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 the girls love it there. Yeah. Um, oh, oh. oh, and the gays. Come <laughs> on, <laughs> be inclusive. Be, uh, vital. Yeah. Vital. <laughs> I don't know what word I was going for there. <laughs> Should regret it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll regret it. What's your next one, Stephen? Not sorting my Thomas Cook refund quicker. Oh, Should have done that. Yeah. Oh. Live and learn, though. Live and learn. Live and learn. I returned a parcel today, so you know, making yeah. great strides. <laughs> And uh, shaving my eyebrow and cavos. <laughs> you regret that? Well, I didn't do a sh- I didn't do a line. I uh, just got, I just got, just got a chunk out by accident. <laughs> <laughs> Had too much time to brew myself. Instead of pre-drinking, I was uh, <laughs> plucking my eyebrows. Then <laughs> I just got a chunk out with a razor by oh, accident. No, if only I had no. Manscaped to do my eyebrows. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, do you know what? I've got a slightly bigger one, so I guess. <gasps> Oh, kind of, he's building us up well you know, when you said about kind of your confidence in school like kind of it's school's a shitty time anyway for yeah. little things to just become big problems in your own head but I used to have really bad skin and I think I let that get the better of me in school yeah. um, certainly in kind of later school college mm-hmm. um, you know there's a, I, I dropped out of college for other reasons but that was probably a part of it that around that time I just wasn't handling that very well so yeah. I look back and I think, you know, why did I care so much? Yeah. There's always worrying and worrying about what other people uh, would think. But, yeah. you know, I look back now and I think time wasted. But yeah. it's made me who I am. So true. It's You're very vain now. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but now you've got good skin. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, so it's, it's improved. It's improved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> any, any smaller regrets, good. Max? Uh, money. Yeah. Wish I didn't spend. <laughs> Twenty pounds and McDonald's could have put that in investing and stuff. Just that twenty pound, like a general no, just kind of thing. Generally, <laughs> yeah. over and the twenty years. pound could be twenty five pounds now. <laughs> <laughs> twenty twenty quid times that by three six five. <laughs> times that by twenty eight. Well, not since birth. <laughs> not yeah, since yeah, yeah. Birth. but you do the math. <laughs> you got twenty pounds to today. Then. <laughs> Don't spend on McDonald's again. <laughs> but yeah, oh, days. Like 365 quid. Yeah. That's a specific amount. Yeah. But, um, I'm all on board. Carry on. Nice. Have you ever regretted something that turned out to be, you know, good? For the yeah. Best? Um, the, the comedy course was for me. Yeah. Mm. First week I was regretting it big time. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. The, com- uh, the comedy course, to begin with, seemed like it was going to be a huge regret. Yeah. Um, it was, yeah, it was a, a weird kind of environment that first few weeks. But yeah, but I say you stuck it out and. It's been, it's been, yeah. this is the thing, it's, it's so many, I guess. Can you call them regrets if you look back on them and go? Yeah, because I mean, I, I met Devon <laughs> doing this, you know, like, my life would be so different. Yeah, yeah. Uh, met us. I did. Well, I've already said that one before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> what do you want from me, mate? <laughs> what is it you want? I just feel like you should have said us again. Yeah. yeah. Why? Or, or our names. Yeah, exactly, nice. by yeah. name. So, mm. Devon. Yeah. Oh, she Devin whipped your bum once. <laughs> <laughs> like I haven't done that five times. Yeah. <laughs> to myself. Yeah. I used to buy you booze. <laughs> 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 McDonald's book. <laughs> You've only wiped your ass five times. <laughs> 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 yeah. Anyway. Uh, Tom regrets sitting there. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice choice. I regret killing my fish. Oh, Ooh, being scared of dogs. I regret. Oh, yeah, I regret yeah. not. Uh, mm. Interacting with dogs at a younger age. Yeah. That well, is a big one to be yeah. fair. My dad dogs. did encourage me, but I uh, just was too afraid to have it. Mm. Yeah. You know, I always think kind of, you know, pick and choose your battles. You know, sometimes it's good to just walk away from something. And there's nothing for you to gain by saying your piece or reacting to something. Yeah. Just, you know, walk away, get a, you know, have a think. And if you still want to say it tomorrow, maybe it's worth saying. But mm. I guess sometimes I wish I'd just say what I think yeah. in a situation. Yeah. Um, you know, when, if someone's, you know, been a bit of a dick. Or, yeah. This, you know, been a bit disrespectful or something. I should just say, but I think sometimes I walk away. That's it. Yeah. So these are small ones. But I did it with an Uber driver once. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I remember. Left fifty quid quid in a uh, cash machine once. Give it ah. a tip. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
That was a regret. Actually, well, it was one of those... Did it go back into your bank, though? No. Uh, well, to be fair, one of those it possibly could have. I just never noticed. If Ooh. someone else doesn't take it, it'll yeah. be sucked back. You don't, you See, don't notice know. 50 quid going out of your bank, though. <laughs> <laughs> I never really look. Um, but I won 20... <laughs> I'm in so much debt. <laughs> <laughs> it either gets accepted or it doesn't. <laughs> it's just one of roll the dice. It's a roll of the dice. No, but I won... It's now time for Stephen Lies. Stephen Lies. Stephen Sweet Little Lies. Oh yeah, he's proper fit and gives me a wide on. <laughs> Never gets old. How much did you pay her to sing that? <laughs> uh, that was Lady Gaga there. <laughs> so she got half a million from. <laughs> you gave her dogs back then. <laughs> <laughs> it's Stephen Lies, and this week Tom is detective. Ooh. Ooh. Ask me no question, I'll tell you no lay. I like the new jingle. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's not the new jingle. Cool. Uh, Lady Gaga original. <laughs> <laughs> Tom, who would you like to go uh, first? Uh, my big boy Smith over here. Oh, oh, not cool, bro. Boy. boy. Man. <laughs> the boys in the hood saw me peeling off Granny's blouse. Oh. <laughs> Is that the film with Cuba Gooding Jr.? <laughs> Oh, I know what I'd go for. Uh, I think the boys in the hood is. Yeah. I know Ice Cube's in that. Oh, I yeah, yeah, that's a good film. That it's yeah. a movie. Film. Yeah, with an actor. I don't think it's mm-hmm. Cuba. Stephen, I've shat myself on one of these seats. <laughs> <laughs> Dave, uh, I once followed my dad into the toilet to do uh, a rude noise. Okay, Dave. I'll elaborate. Elabor- yeah, if you could. Um, so it's in Mexico. We was on holiday, and I was following my dad to the toilet because I needed the toilet as well as him. Oh, what else can you uh, do in Mexico? Yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> and me and my dad, we're quite similar in the banter we have with each other. So I'll do a fart noise, he'll do a fart noise like, whilst we're going to the toilet. So everyone go, "Oh, what are they doing? Like, what? Oh, is he just farted? How embarrassing! Uh, we're, we're, we're mad lads, you see." Um, so That's I, what you anticipated them to say. <laughs> like, insane. Like, everyone's like, can we hang around with you guys? Um, so we're, anyway, we're doing this. I, I, I followed him in to do it. I needed a wee as well. Uh, but I didn't go. I was waiting for him to go. And then as he walked in, I was doing it constantly. And it was at this point I realised I was in the girls' toilets and I didn't actually follow my dad in. Someone else walked past and I followed them. I know, you'd followed I was your quite, I wasn't paying attention. I was, must have been looking at a butterfly or something, I yeah, assume. Yeah. Um, and, and I'd followed through. <laughs> and they had like, you know, they had, when you go on holiday, you get the dressing gown sort of thing. It was one of them. And they, nice. they were wearing the same dressing yeah. gown. Followed hey, them mate, I, I've accidentally walked into the girls' toilets Exactly. Before, so and it was... Mis- you do it. It happens. Um, <laughs> making fart noises <laughs> You had to get Devon well. to wipe your bum. <laughs> yeah. I'm with you, Devon. I've done it again. <laughs> It won't stop. <laughs> Just gaping them open. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to smell you, Devon. <laughs> <laughs> Loving this, isn't it? Uh, yeah. waiting, out, waiting outside. You seen a girl with glasses? <laughs> <laughs> Do you mind doing it? <laughs> Very good. Uh, uh, Stephen. Hi there. Hi. Uh, you, you shut yourself on one of these seats? <gasps> yep. Did you? Uh, when was this? It was, what was it, Monday? <laughs> Monday? <laughs> last, last Monday. Last we did the big Monday. shop. Mm. So yeah. we got a lot of food in. And I'm not great at rationing. So <laughs> had some muesli. Had some more muesli. Had another bowl of muesli. I got into it, okay? Yeah. Mm. Had a great time enjoying that. Um, what else did I have? A little bit of fruit juice. That was it. Mm. I overindulged on the muesli. Um, <laughs> <laughs> had dinner. And then I was, uh, I was just sat out here, chilling, maximum relaxing, shooting some pool, <laughs> watching a few YouTube videos, Robbie Fowler podcast, nice, great fun. Nice, nice. Uh, Not the Francos? Wingate. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching Wingate and I just sharted. To <laughs> <laughs> just to feel something, mate. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't write a hateful enough comment. <laughs> uh, no, I was playing out here with, uh, with young Zoe. We were on the, she was on the carpet. She was on the, she was on the carpet, sort of like this. Oh yeah. Uh, on the back, and uh, fully clothed. And I, uh, <laughs> and I said, "Oh, let me put your feet on my on my body, and I'll try and try and get you to raise me." Oh. <laughs> Do you know, like when they, they you're yeah. on your back and you are yeah, pushing yeah. them up in the air with your feet? Uh, so we tried that. 
didn't work at all. No. So when I was doing it for her, uh, pushing up, I felt a little bit of something. And when I sat down, oh. I just slipped. Not out. not a shit. Right. Just so you didn't shit yourself. Just a just a wet patch that happened to be brown. <laughs> A follow through. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a, a fart that's not safe. I'm on the, the same board. I understand that. Yeah, but on the, which seat was it? Oh, it'd be this one. It yeah, th- that side. <laughs> that side was over there. Yeah, near by the carpet. Uh, in fact, in fact, <laughs> yeah. most likely my seat. <laughs> well, it was all the seats. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because this uh, is uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. I've uh, gathered all the information I need uh, with regards to that. Matt Smith, the boys oh. in the hood, saw you peeling off Granny's blouse. Yeah, uh, peeling, peeling. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, cast your mind back. I was about 16, 16 years of age. Yeah. Uh, I was living at my grandmother's at the time. Yeah. Nice. And uh, if you know anything about grandmothers, mm-hmm. they love to work in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> So she was out at the front. Uh, if you know anything about weird grandkids, <laughs> <laughs> they love to watch. <laughs> you know, 16, you're horny. You know? <laughs> nothing, nothing like that at all, mate. Uh, so I was, I was living at a house. It was an education. And she, she came in and she was like, hey, hey, bro. Uh, hey, bro. If you want to, if you want to, you know. See my tits. I, <laughs> I'm giving you room and board here for free. Yeah, <laughs> it's time to earn your keep, Max. Lick them. <laughs> a bit weird, a bit creepy, bit, 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 a little bit too sexual. <laughs> what, the, what, what you're saying? No, Got no, a taste what of what this, Granny saying. Smith. <laughs> right, okay. I've not once mentioned Granny's tits. <laughs> yeah, so she's like, all right, it's heavily implied. I, I need oh. you to come out and trim my bush. <laughs> so I say, all That's right. Uh, the issue is that all my clothes are like shirts Bomb. and stuff. <laughs> So That's I need like to a terrible script for a pod. <laughs> <laughs> to be can't. naked to do it. <laughs> oh, okay. I could. I needed. I needed a shirt basically to you know help her trim stuff. <laughs> so she's like, "Oh, I've Scratch got a lovely. Track. I've got a lovely blouse you can wear." So I put the blouse on. It's fuck. You know, it's an old woman's blouse for Christ's sake. So I'm out the front <laughs> digging and, and sh- uh, trimming. <laughs> And I'm like, oh boy, am I hot? <laughs> Not his words, the words of the neighbour. <laughs> Covered, forehead sweating. Yeah. So I take the blouse off. Just to mop your brow. Yeah, just to, you know, just yeah, I just take it off because it's, it's it's a hot hot day uh, in in you know Granny's garden. And as I'm peeling it off, a group of lads who were wearing hoodies walked past. Oh, no. Saw me take off this old woman's top <laughs> off myself. <laughs> And they laughed at me, and I went, huh, "Yeah, <laughs> would you like to?" I deserve that. I know who I'd go for. Oh, it's a tricky one, um, Dave. I'm, I'm going to discount yours. Okay. Um, nice. I'm going to go. Stephen is telling the truth. It's Max. Yeah. <laughs> it was my facial expression. So it was my. Uh, I've got you. Yes. I should. Why didn't I? Go? I knew it. it was. Why didn't I go? With was it? Was it the summer? Yeah, it was a hot summer. <laughs> what Extremely else did you hot. Do the summer holidays. <laughs> <laughs> I've just had spring break. <laughs> uh, I basically yeah. So all my clothes are like shirt, like yeah. smart shirt. So I was like, I can't wear that. And she's like, Oh, you can wear this blouse. I was like, <laughs> Fuck off! No, I'm not wearing that. But you wore it. But she was like, no, you, I need help. She did. She's, you know, old woman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh my God, fine. God, if it's the back garden. She's like, no, it's the front. And I, Why don't you just work topless, you 16-year-old, young mm-hmm. strapping lad? Yeah, but, you know, you know. her neighbours had eyes for that. Yeah, well, um, well done. Did you, did, they, did you ever see the lads again? No, they were like, they were local, but not so local that they probably ever walked down that street apart from that one fucking time. But well, they never came back again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They, were no, they were never seen again. <laughs> There's a difference, Stephen. Yeah. That kid lives there. <laughs> Stay away. Cross the road. <laughs> it is now time to get into your your regrets, guys. First one. I'll, I'll put it on screen now. But he said this terrible tattoo uh, that you see it there. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Oh, mum and dad. See, I can read that. No. I thought it said porn, if you see it that way. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's awful. Um, yeah. Terrible tattoo, that. 
Do you reckon? Do you reckon his parents were against tattoos, and he got that so they couldn't be annoyed? Yeah. He's like, oh, oh yeah, it's for you, mum and dad. Yeah. My mum's very <laughs> against it. about the swastika on your back, man? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's for granddad. <laughs> My brother once hid his tattoos for a whole year. Where were they? Uh, one on his back. <laughs> one was on his, his cheek. He had to go around <laughs> like that. <laughs> <laughs> one on half his arm. I once, he, he wouldn't come home to get a jumper. It was because uh, he was cold at a house party. Yeah. Because you know, he didn't want it, my mum to see his like half done sleeve. So he uh, got me to walk and drop him off a jumper. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, that was the whole thing. Oh, we need. Was that the party you went to? And like, what? <laughs> no, <yeah. laughs> James, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, this next one is from Jack. When I was in year five slash six, my mate pantsed me completely. In brackets, boxers came down. Oh. In front of a yeah. girl. Oh. oh. <laughs> in an aim to protect myself. For some reason, I covered my ass and pushed my cock even further out for everyone to see. <laughs> That's the best way to deal with that. I deeply regret not just putting my hands in front of my cock and pulling my trousers up. Yeah, fuck me. Ever but been pantsed? I have, but not to that extent. Yeah. Grandma! Grandma, <laughs> <laughs> send me dress as well, Max. Take them off, take them off. What do you sound like that? A little goblin <laughs> woman. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're not You'll grandma. Get on You'll get on chains. You'll get on chains. Yeah, no, I, I, I have, but like, luckily... Because I've got a fat ass. Mm. Uh, it's, 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 it just wouldn't come down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Imagine, imagine just a poop falls out. <laughs> yeah, let's imagine that, yeah. Or change. I mean, you. I mean, in general. <laughs> fucking imagine that, boys. Boy. <laughs> this little <laughs> shit. <laughs> Gather around the campfire, lads. <laughs> <laughs> it was at that moment that he said to himself. No! Oh, oh you've won. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever been pants, Stephen? Yeah. I feel like you I'm have. sure I have. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely in PE. You've yeah. pants people yourself, haven't you? Yeah, I used to Notorious. do it to Ryan <laughs> all the time. I used to do it to Ryan in a in different <laughs> Manchester <laughs> nightclub. Yeah, in a nightclub. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The dream, the dream for me it was genuinely to to pull his pants down and then Tom to put a drink in his pants. <laughs> so when he pulls it up, <laughs> he just soaks his crotch. Oh. We never quite got there, but oh, uh, we. Ryan. I mean, you know, there's someone to still a chance for that. Absolutely. Absolutely. I think he's bought belts since then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I used to whip down his chinos. Um, <laughs> chinos. Same person. I also know someone who sent an accidental dick pic to a science group chat with the full class in. Doesn't get much worse than that. Oh, At least it's terrible. science. Yeah. You can just say biology. It's not mine. Yeah. Watching this guy's. Yeah. Just mm. looking for a scientific, a medical yeah. opinion. Yeah. Uh, anyone really, else got this it, photo? If in it's their physics, book. you could say is, is anyone you know, attracted yeah. to that? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Forces. Yeah. 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 Push or really pushing getting into search. biology. Or if it's space, you go look at this comet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Just> swinging around. <laughs> Imagine if the world ended because of a dick shape. <laughs> Meteor just <laughs> Oh you're joking <laughs> A lot of these are about Farting and shitting uh, <laughs> Farting and shit. <laughs> they know the podcast well Oh this one This one was one of my favourites My biggest regret Was when I was like nine And I thought it was a good idea To scream my lungs off Whilst I was in the swimming pool For some reason I didn't think that everyone Could hear me So I was just screaming For a good 15 minutes It still haunts me to this day so when she was under the water, under the water. she was screaming, thinking no one else can hear. <laughs> <laughs> and she'd come up, everyone was just looking at her. Oh no, I think I've done that. So what are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, have you ever done that where you've got your mouth closed yeah. and you talk and you yeah. think no one else can hear? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I, yeah, I, I, thought, I, I thought you couldn't hear it. No. You know, Rob Brydon had a whole career from doing that man in the box thing. Uh, or man in himself, what is it? I don't man know. in the box, yeah, man, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I understand in the box, but underwater, I never realised uh, yeah. you could hear. And you scream. Oh, I didn't yeah. know that. Well, that's that's uh, nice to know. Going in for a kiss on my best mate. She hasn't spoke to me since. Oh. oh. We'll be in there. Leave your mates alone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a bad move. Um, it's now time for a tasty little segment known as IMAX. Yeah. Yeah, IMAX, yeah. You seem upset. No, it's all right. It's, um... I just... I just did the lowercase I sort of mm. pronounce yeah. it that way? Do you know I'm not? I'm, I wasn't even paying attention. I was rude. thinking of you know rude. you're asking about regrets, and I, I've got a few. That, that was earlier in the podcast. Yeah, we were asking right. earlier, weren't we? About yeah, no, I'm, I forgot. Big part, big you part of the podcast. Let's hear about his bloody party. Exactly. <laughs> that was a riveting. Yeah, no, it was. It was. <laughs> yeah. If you can keep that energy you had when you heard that story, and yeah, uh, I'll tell you about this uh, audition I had. Oh, well, I look forward to it. 
You all right? Yeah, Is this just, recent? Yeah, you know, during the coronavirus pandemic. It's not, it's not like <laughs> IMAX. <laughs> Oh. I just a, me and a mate, uh, mate, mate of mine's good actor. Great friends, great friends. We had an audition yeah. together, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, and that was IMAX. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna thanks for letting off your chest, We've mate. We've got audio from okay, it. Oh, Joe's got a scoop. Oh, poop scoop. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the IMAX experience. Enjoy the show. Who oh boy, IMAX has finally made it to the big time. Here we are at the biggest stage of all. You're serious, aren't you? Oh, come on, Bobby D. Hit actor from such movies as Meet the Fockers and Meet the Fockers 2. What other stage is as prestigious as this? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. You shut the fuck up and sit down. I didn't review a bug's life in School of Rock to be hoo hard at by some has-been actor. You're only here to help me audition. You finished? Yeah, sorry lad. Oh look, it's starting. Hello and welcome to the first semi-final of Britain's Got Talent 2020! See, I told you that if we act our hearts out here, we can get some nice big juicy rolls. Oh, it's us. Next up tonight are a father and son magic duo that were a huge hit at the Manchester audition. Wow, what an honour and a privilege it is to be here, guys. It's good to have you here with us. Ah well, if people are hungry for talent, I'm here to dish it out. <coughs> yeah, that's not funny. Wow, you sound like the Stephen Tries podcast audience after IMAX plays. Fuck off. I've given you this almighty audience, Bobby. What more could you want? I'd like you to go get my dry cleaning. Oh, I've got to get it because I wore your trousers once. He left skid marks. Okay, Robert D's nuts. I make the jokes here. No, I think we've had enough of your jokes. Bring it, lad. Owie! My nose, it's bleeding. People keep their distance. <laughs> no, I don't have the Rona. I'm just really hurt. And I love it! Get to fuck, lad. This is meant to be my moment to shine. I'm Mad Max, king of cinema, ruler of reviewers. You can't stop me from... Piece of shit. Lol. Didn't realise you had that audio, Joe. <laughs> wow. Uh. <laughs> Sorry you had to go through that. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> Were you talking to the audience, so... <laughs> Sounds like uh, an emotional roller coaster. I've still got the bullet inside me. I need to go flush it out. Right. <sighs> Could have done it before the podcast, yeah, really. Yeah. Time in, mate. Time wait. <laughs> yeah, go on. Uh, in the meantime, Dave. Yeah. If I'm not mistaken, it's your birthday soon. Oh, guys. Is <laughs> actually when is it? It's uh. It would have been well, it'd be today. Yeah, yeah. When it, it comes will, out, yeah, it will be today. Yeah. When, Happy oh, birthday! Thank you. Thank Happy you birthday, guys. Dave! Thank you, uh, Dave. I've got you some great, great gifts. Oh, uh, oh, I'm all shy now. We'll start off with this. <laughs> oh, oh yes! <laughs> yeah. oh. Is there a nice dark? You can see it there, West Ham. Because ah. you like West Ham, oh, and you dude. like you like to wonder where they it go. Does go. That yeah. is that is fantastic. That's to be fair, great. if that does go somewhere, then yeah. where is that going to go? Um, it's going to go in my toilet, not in the toilet. Right, good. In the bathroom. Right, okay. Harsh. Like. Um, Oh, that's nice. Next really up, nice. fitting with the theme of uh, of what you got up to. Oh, that's the nuts. Yeah. Oh, fuck the Irish whiskey. <laughs> Peaky blinder. Oh, that's so nice. Oh. And then the last present. Open oh, up that. Thank the you. The listeners can hear you open hey. it. Yes, lad. It's a bong. <laughs> yeah. That's great fun. Oh, that is class. Yeah. yeah mate. <laughs> oh, <I guess>. Hello. <laughs> Hello. The entertainment's oh. arrived for the for the birthday boy. Entertainment. Oh. Oh. Don't remember booking entertainment. You don't need to book with me. I uh, know I've got magic powers. <laughs> <laughs> every every time little boy and girl has birthday, I say, "Oh, it's time for me to fly," <sighs> and I, I fly to where they are at that moment. Is that a bus ticket? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's a bus ticket and the census for <laughs> the Salford area really helps, I have to say. No, it's it's me again, boys. Jerry Christmas. Oh, oh Jerry Christmas. Oh, Jerry. Yeah, you I remember me. How could I forget? Yeah. <laughs> I've got some prezzies for everyone. Oh, wow. Do, do you want to pass them out? 
Yeah. <laughs> you having a little wank in there, Jerry? <laughs> I've got a hole in bottom of bag. Yeah, you crafty oh, yeah, sod. Yeah. Can you give me five minutes? <laughs> Any listeners at home, Jerry's just having a tug. Oh, Through a tug on these. Oh, silvers. Yeah. Oh, oh, wow. I uh, got them for Joe from Jam Joe. Yeah, Jam Joe. Jam Joe. Jam Joe. Jam Joe. Hairy Joe, that's what we used to call you down pub, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Walking hair bag oh. Joe. <laughs> It is for you, Dave, because I heard you like burgerism. Oh, yeah, I love burgerism. You can use this burgerism. Oh, nice I'll, I'll catch it if you chuck it, Jerry. Oh, what? Wait, what a catch. Oh, Thank you, Lovely I am a throw, catch. Jerry. That's what my wife used. says. Oh, my wow, favorite. burgerism. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's a combination of burger and... Isms. Yeah. Nice. Fascism. I love an ism. I just had one in my bag. <laughs> <laughs> That's my gift. <laughs> for Tom, I've heard about your, your uh, poopy problems oh yeah <laughs> and i thought you might be a bit stressed out so i got you some used cigs you can use them they're like sig free cigs they're healthy them and these have been used yeah that's lovely jake does tom get to keep them this time or are you well, gonna take them back <laughs> when, when the yeah, podcast's over yeah you don't need to be so incensed about it <laughs> i've been planning that it is the entertainment <laughs> yeah I've been planning that one long. Yeah, a long time. What about if Dave had a problem with his gift? Yeah. What would like, you say to him? Shut the fuck up, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> That's Jerry Chris. You get what you're given. What about yeah. Stephen? Yeah, yeah. I was Steve, I got you a present. I can't throw it, though. Oh, wow. Oh, thank oh, you. Very nice. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's a new lamp. Oh, that's... <laughs> That's lovely. But it's from a country that I don't understand what country it's from because the plug's a bit different. Ooh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh. Yeah, just a two-prong <laughs> plug. I think it's from China. Oh, yeah, I yeah. think so. Oh, that's, that's your fantastic. That. So lucky. Yeah. Wish I had one of them. I love the colour. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, is that? Yeah, little. There's a bit of hair. Little pube or an eyelash. Probably, oh. probably a beard, hair or a pube. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's brilliant, mate. That's uh, class. Have you had much work since Christmas is finished? No, so you know Santa, he only works one day a year. Yeah. I work, I only have one day off a year. Wow, what day is that? <laughs> Yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I thought you looked replenished. Yeah, you did. yeah I had a really good sleep. <laughs> yeah. And then I did all my chores for day. <laughs> what was that? Clean house. Nice. Get all... Good <laughs> house. Dirty. Really dirty. I've not cleaned it for a year. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell. <laughs> Yeah, it's really filthy. Do you live alone, Jerry? No, I, I live with my three kids. What are they called? Otto, Blotto, and Clotto. <laughs> Look, little rocks with face painted on it. <laughs> I love them so much. They're my little boys and girls. Which one's the girl? Oh, I love them. <laughs> uh, any plans for the rest of the year? It work. <laughs> what do you work as, Jerry? <laughs> fucking entertainer for birthday parties I just worry in that the Salford area turning up unannounced yeah. and giving out presents isn't going to make you much money <laughs> I, a bit I, odd I, who needs money this day and age <laughs> Jerry um, any, any messages to the viewers if it's your birthday coming up unlock all your doors and windows yeah do you want them to post their address in the comments yeah post your address and your mother's maiden name <laughs> is this how you made your money do you rob people Jerry I don't want this lamp off a yeah. thief See you, Jerry. See ya. Yeah, go on, Jerry. Bye, Jerry. Off your trot. Where are you going, guys? <laughs> Shallow. <laughs> Should call you Russell Christmas with that fucking bag. Hey. Do you need a hand, Jerry? Yeah. Bags, bags rustling. Or oh, homeless Christmas, because he oh, looks... Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Violent. Just helping you up. Wow. Bye, Jerry. Bye, Jerry. What a magnificent <laughs> creature. <laughs> it's now time for a new segment. Ooh. Dave's Rave Reviews. Uh, so Dave, this segment, yep. you're, you're going to experience a slice of life. Yeah, yeah. And then review it for us. Yeah, yeah. Can so the viewers at home will know whether it's worth them doing. Mm, mm. Exactly. That's what I'm going. That's what I'm here to. Uh, I'll elaborate you all. I'm here to inform you. Uh, I don't elaborate them enough, you know. No, no, yeah. no. A lot of the could com- all be more elaborate. Exactly, exactly. The comments have been saying it for a long, a time, a long time, so it's about yeah. time you stepped up, mate. And Cheers. Put up to the the state, the poll. Put them up to the state. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know. I'm just, you know. I'm just going off my own brain here. Yeah, we can tell. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Joe, take it away. Adventures 
Dave's adventures. He's about to go and have some fun. Ventures. Dave's adventures. He's about to tell everyone. Hello. First episode of Dave's adventures. I journeyed out to the Peaky Blinds movie set where I was hoping to bump into not only the second person in command, like the director or some at, uh, so I could get an acting job, but yes, the man himself, Killian Murphy. Yeah, thank you. Um, when I walked around Castlefield, lovely place, it is a lovely place. Walked around, saw some closed bars that we might take a sneaky peek into on the 21st of August, I believe, or April. Eva Riva, it's got an A in it. When I went there, I was surprised to see it all gated off. I was like, that's a bit rude. People that are big fans of the show wanted to go see the Tavern Inn, or whatever it's called. I forgot, but it was brilliant. Not only did I not see that, I saw a fence with a grumpy security guard. Brilliant he was, such a laugh. Told us to do one in a matter of seconds of showing up. Anyway, I did see a few decent things to be fair. I saw the lamppost, you know, the famous lamppost that no one fucking remembers. I saw the uh, bar that everyone goes to. Well, I'll say I saw the bar. I saw the sign. Um, And that's about it, really. I wore a hat. That was nice. Got a photo. That was nice. Uh, was going to get a subway, ran out of money, so uh, that wasn't so nice. Um, hopefully next Dave's Adventures will be a little more exhilarating. Thanks for listening to Adventures. Dave's Adventures. He's about to go and have some fun. Ventures. Dave's Adventures. He just told everyone. Well done, Dave. Hold okay, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say your applause. Say your applause. Ventures. Dave's Ventures. No. No, it's all right. So if you've got any questions at all, uh, from away, I'm more than happy oh, to... questions about this security guard. Yeah, security guard. He was a uh, big guy, a bit grumpy in my opinion. I feel like uh, telling you to do one. Yeah, right. He wouldn't, he wouldn't mm. say that to older people. No, no. well, we was taking photos. Or photo, a lady. Like, we was going to yeah. take photos against the fence... Like uh, leaning, you know, when they do the lean and tail pizza, yeah. like in the background, yeah. I was going to lean on the thingy. Nice. Um, and you just got the arm about that. <laughs> the yeah. thing is, you, you could just lean on the thing. Could, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I wanted to do like the whole lamp. Doesn't require thing, a trick shot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, he weren't happy. So we we skipped his side and went round to the other side because it's on the two nice. sides. And that's where I saw the bar. Yeah, nice. garrison. The garrison. the garrison. Yeah, or the tab. Yeah, gar- that's it. Garrison. Garrison tab. Um, uh, that was nice. Uh, got blisters on my feet walking round. Oh, it wasn't, it wasn't it's so a lot nice. Cobbles, isn't there? It is. It is. And I weren't wearing the quick wear the right shoes. footwear. Yeah. Mm. Don't like cobbles. No. Yeah. No. Pointless. Um, but yeah, I, I'm gonna give it a rating. Uh, just wow. gonna, I'm gonna do a rating yeah. things now. Uh, keep an eye at home because I'm not. Uh, out of ten, we're gonna give it. I'm give it a five. Solid five. Really? Solid, yeah, 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 yeah. Bang average. Wow. So I had a nice day. But yeah. the but the guard is, is he's let it yeah. down. And the fact Killian Murphy yeah. or no one was there you, to greet us. You didn't really have an experience. No, no. <laughs> Sorry to hear that, Dave. I yeah. was only outside the gate. Um, didn't I was, even meet the second in command director. No, no. I was, I was hoping to get. A, I wore my hat. Wore my hat and everything. Yeah. Did you do your Brummie accent? I, d- I did. I was like, hello. I'm, I'm from <laughs> Brummie. Is uh, that when the guard said do one? Yeah, do one. He's yeah. like, you ain't getting a job, mate. I was wearing Nike and a hat, and I was like, with well, the blade in it. Yeah. yeah. I, I like, think the guard might have more of a reason to say do exactly, one. Yeah. I'm exactly. with him on this one. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, I was going to... Sounds but, like he's um, doing a good job. He was uh, rude. Yeah. yeah. Um, but uh, that was... Nah. Uh, Dave's rave reviews. Dave's rave reviews. <laughs> Dave, stay here now, because... Oh. We have our first ever mastermind. Oh. Yeah, that's right. We put it to Max, it to D- different <laughs> words, different yeah, segment, different. Uh, to challenge you with some great questions. Okay. You have 90 seconds to answer as many questions based on naughty Two. films. Naughty. Drop a naughty. <laughs> yes, yeah, Three, two, one, go. Who plays the Prime Minister in Love Actually? Um... Oh, Pierce Morgan. Pierce Brosnan. Pierce no, wrong. wrong. It's Hugh Grant. Hugh wrong. Grant. Uh, 
always get confused. In Twilight, which two teams could you be a fan of? Uh, Robert Patterson and Jake Gyllenhaal. Jake, Jacob. <laughs> Jacob, Jacob no, wrong. Wrong. Team Edward, Team Shit. Jacob. On which film set did Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie meet? Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Correct. Yes. Of which ship is Jack Sparrow the captain? Uh, Black Pearl. Yep. Which 2014 film began production in 2001? Uh, Avatar. The two. Boyhood. It took 12 years to make. In what year did both The Dark Knight and Iron Man get released in theatres? 2008. Yes. What was the highest grossing film of the noughties? Uh, Avatar. Yes. According to Movie Phone's list of 50 best movies of the decade, what movie ranked number one? Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. No. What film won the most Oscars in the noughties? Uh, and is the highest overall? Avatar. No. Which noughties film was first to win a Best Picture Oscar? I'm going to go say Titanic. No. Which film included Rabbit singing the first song of its kind to win an Oscar for Best Original Song? Watership Down. No. Uh, which film involves the best kept village competition being taken all too seriously? Oh, uh, that's, uh, yeah, Hot Fuzz. Yeah, yes. Nice. In which Done. film? Ah, how many to get? Five. Oh, not bad. Not bad. Yeah. Not bad. Thank you, guys. Got more than I did. Everyone oh, in the nice comments, one. please, you know, let us know what you'd like Dave to put his mind to next. next. Not apartheid. Draw right. that out. I'm, quite, I'm not good with science. It is night time for Tom Looney. Looney, 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 Looney. So this week, I, 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 it's, it's regrets, isn't it? It's, yeah. It's hard to be, you know, really positive about this. So this one might be a little grim, but um, a little grim. It's you know re- reflective. Uh, so this week, it's the five biggest regrets that people on their deathbed um, all oh, kind God. of shared. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to read down from five to number one. Oh. Number five, I wish I'd let myself be happier. Wow. That's a bit Joe, cool. read yeah. the room. That's Joe making himself happy. Yeah, though. yeah. So, fair on. Yeah. Oh, watch an elephant, Paul. <laughs> I always think with that, think positive thoughts. That's so true. Yeah, yeah well, this is it. Uh, this is, Unless um, you're doing COVID. <laughs> <laughs> uh, number four, I wish I'd stayed in touch with my friends. You see, a lot of people try and connect with their friends, but later later in life, it's, they often leave it too late Forget. and can't trap people yeah. down. So, you know, just check just in, guys. Will do. Don't leave it too long. Going right. to wear my Netherlands kit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll support you. Go back to my primary school. It's mm. <laughs> <laughs> me, guys. Let me in. <laughs> <laughs> you could uh, meet up with the boys in the hood. Yeah, yeah of course. Uh, or the blouses. Imagine they're, they're all wearing s- blouses now. Yeah. You inspired us, man. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> We're all gardeners too. Yeah. Hey, if they're still around, they grew up to be Alan Titch. <laughs> uh, they probably regret laughing at you. Yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> Where did the shears go? Back to? <laughs> Number three, I wish I'd had the courage to express my feelings. Oh, no. this one commonly shared, uh, commonly expressed by men. Okay. If you uh, if you watch um, the Straight Outta Compton, they use the song "Express Yourself." You got any feelings you wish you'd expressed? Yeah. Uh, (laughs) number two I wish I hadn't worked so much another one that apparently every man said Uh, obviously you know we're we're losing an older generation at the minute and have Mm. been over the past few years so maybe you know with ourselves we'll we'll look to rectify that Mm. yeah yeah yeah, you know, you don't get that time back, guys. I don't work enough. No, you don't. <laughs> That's mine. <laughs> You're on the other side yeah, yeah, yeah. of the spectrum. I need to work I need to work more. Yeah. He's I'm not even dying. He's just on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> Been asked to move. <laughs> Fuck off, Jim. <Jenna. laughs> yeah, and the number one um, that uh, of people who've been told they've got a limited amount of time left to live. I wish I had the courage to live a life true to myself and not the lives other not the life others expected of me. Most people expressed that they hadn't even got close to realising, uh, you know, even half their dreams. Yeah. And they all conceded that it was down to the choices that they had made. Because mm-hmm. they've been on the bands and mm-hmm. Yeah. Or mm-hmm. yeah. well, if you're a bad singer and you want to be a singer, you're just bad. Just, I mean, but you, you know, I mean, at least, at least you could try, I guess. Yeah, I yeah, Do you, you want to be a singer, bad. Dave? <laughs> if you are a bad, no, nah, not get personally. Up the stage. Yeah. I just watched X Factor the other day and some people's dreams to be singers. Yeah. And you just think, have you heard yourself? Yeah, yeah, I used to have that with comedy when yeah. I used to see people doing stand-up yeah. and I was like, you're not funny. No, I know it's no. subjective, but... Yeah. Yeah. Mm. 
But anyway, yeah, that was Tom Looney. Just uh, hey, he's Looney. Hey, 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 you know, not, not, so, <laughs> not so outrageous. You're fucking week. mental. <laughs> just you know. <laughs> Here's 10 minutes of the most depressing stuff. Lune, Lune, Lune. Lune. We can't control it. Philosophy. <laughs> uh, Tom, pick up your phone, mate, because it's put it to the max. Put it max. Put it to the max. Na, 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 na. Put it to the max. Put it to the max. It's time for put it to the max. Put it to the max. We've done that. It's yeah, part of the show where, you know, we read out of... Yeah, um... <laughs> There's no one new around this podcast. <laughs> the viewing figures just go down a few each week. <laughs> oh. We'll be on the get to the hardcore 20 in a few weeks. <laughs> oh, I imagine. A real tight-knit bunch. That's really depressing. <laughs> it's just against the world. <laughs> you may as well join in. I'll get them all over. <laughs> get an extender on this one. <laughs> <laughs> we wouldn't need to record it, would we? <laughs> <laughs> we still would. Just in case one of them gets bored. Yeah, yeah. Racist grandpa is uh, the subject of this email. My grandpa is a sweet old man. His only issue is he hates white people. Like, oh. a lot. <laughs> Can't, can't deserve it. I'm sorry, I be. take him to the local Asda and he just ends up throwing graham crackers at all the white folk there. I take him to the local multiplex and he throws popcorn at the white folk as they try and enjoy their movie. <laughs> the issue is, he's a white man himself. What can I do? That's that's a tricky situation. It yeah. is. Uh, I, guess, I guess maybe this grandpa has been hurt by... You know, a white person yeah maybe some white folk and he's gone yeah, I'll fuck the lot of you which mm. is the wrong approach yeah should we act this out then to try and resolve the issue <laughs> yeah. we've got the yeah. granddad the grandson oh. cinema staff <laughs> yeah yeah and uh, supermarket staff yeah, yeah. yeah. It was to be the granddad. You, you're, you're no, no, I think you are. You are of age. I'll go with some, I'll, I'll be no, staff. you're of age. I'll be staff. I'll be you're staff. of age. Tom. I reckon. Uh, I think granddad. I'll be staff. I'll be staff. Yeah, nice. good this, 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 this is a leading role, you know. This is. Uh, hey, no, Tom. No, you'll regret no, if you don't no, do no, this. No, no. <laughs> Maybe you should be grandson because you're next. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Cinema. Yeah. Yeah. Supermarket. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Either either. Okay. All right, Granddad, let's go to supermarket and buy some bloody food for a week. Okay, Granddad. Oh, nice cinema. <laughs> cinema, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold a second. <laughs> you don't leave City World leaving a shit tip in screen three, you old cheeky son. Say that. <laughs> Get out the way. <laughs> <laughs> Get out the way. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll kick your dentures down your fucking throat. That's a City World promise. I just, I just want a free cinema ride. You're not coming in here with your pockets full of sweets. I don't know what you're on about. I'll just get rid of me, me snickles. Snickles? <laughs> me snickles. <laughs> snickles. Surely you're on board with this foreign gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm as white as they come. I, th- I don't think you need they in there. Oh. Uh, do you like <laughs> cheers Joe <laughs> I mean, cheers Joe I mean, uh, excuse me I thought we banned you yeah. get your ass <laughs> you kept putting Lassie on he's <laughs> 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 up on the screen man. again <laughs> he's put a hole in the bloody screen <laughs> and Beethoven he's watching the lot <laughs> <laughs> Chuck a bit of Kojo on a fucking <laughs> hobbit. <He's> c- <laughs> Marley and me comes for tea. Come <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's a fucking class. Well, I oh. think we have it there. That's it. That's it. Solves your you problem. Yeah. The answer's in there somewhere. Make of that what you will. <laughs> this is, yeah, this is like... Uh, <laughs> Interpreting, yeah, yeah. You know, yeah like we're not going to spell everything. It's like the Bible, isn't it? You know, <laughs> yeah. if we gave you the fucking answers, what's the point? Yeah, you've got you've got to learn yourself, uh, grandson. Yeah. It's like yeah. a prophet. They don't send you everything. Like yeah, they send you snippets from a different time as well. Yeah, exactly. It's now time for the final question. It's the final question. <laughs> Thank you to. <laughs> Whatever fucking rock band made that song. Europe, yeah. Europe, yes. Europe. I wonder what uh, I wonder what the granddad would make of Europe. Yeah, Europe. Probably be for it. The Who question. Knows? Who knows? Different kind of question this week. Oh, nice. I like it. What's something that if you don't change now, you'll live to regret? Uh, I think more. Mine, mine's probably more like die and regret because of the smoking and stuff. Wow. 
Mic drop. <laughs> wow. Well, because you well, you could have like a health issue. Well, I mean, people that smoke tend to die. We all die, Everyone mate. Everyone dies, mate, yeah. Yeah, yeah. but young and beautiful. <laughs> 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 You're well, some of those things. <laughs> <laughs> mm. well, you're not young, so... No, no. Yeah, exactly. no, it could be. Compared to the old Japanese pers- pe- person. Yeah, that's true, actually, yeah. yeah Japanese, you know, I'm young and sprightful. And I think that's how Dave runs his scale of yeah. age. Yeah. Mm. What? Um, uh, what's something you'd change now? Um, probably your diaper, eh? <laughs> no, re- ah, but no regrets. We win. <laughs> no regrets. <laughs> <laughs> really didn't happen. Um, putting things off, I think procrastinating. Yeah. Uh, you know, I think you look back and you realise you know you've been saying you're going to do something and you haven't done it yet. It's kind of, yeah. you know, it's you're only you are only going to regret it. Yeah. Um, Twitch stream, Max. Yeah. Yes. Come on, people are crying yes. for it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I Twitch stream. <laughs> Joe, why'd you have to take it there? Just trying to be a bit more aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking twat! <laughs> <sighs> Joe, jo, what's something that uh, if you, you'll you live to regret, you reckon, if you don't change? Um, <laughs> Treat my dog better. <laughs> <laughs> my dog is treated very well. Probably uh, the food I put on my body. Thank you. Nice. <laughs> Wow! Stop walking your dog with a butt plug. Subscribe to Wing It. Yes. <laughs> yeah, you get. T- <laughs> so what did you say? <laughs> so much going on here. So much to take in. Uh, Subscribe to Wing It. <laughs> to see a man slowly kill himself. <laughs> <laughs> From now on, he's just going to cook them and scrape them into the bin. <laughs> Not this time. <laughs> no, Not no, today. No. <laughs> I want Winget to go on for another 50 years. <laughs> <laughs> wow, well, look at all this delicious fried chicken. I'll take the salad. Good times. In a Wings restaurant, just reviewing the water. <laughs> Oh, oh, sparkling! That's food. Then. <laughs> I've got I so like much it. more energy. <laughs> oh. Oh, you don't Good change effort. now. Uh, yeah, Dave, uh, go to the hospital more. <laughs> um, reason yeah, being, I don't do that. Reason being yeah. is I've got a pain on my gut, right just below my gut, and I can't tell if it's muscle or organs. <laughs> So, Muscle or uh, organs? New segment. <laughs> it's probably it's probably trapped wind. Uh, oh. It might like it aches, but I don't need poo. Right. Okay. Is it? it I mean, it's, it's all your digestive system there, yeah, so it's probably like gas. Don't eat great. Like Maybe you should eat better. Yeah. Eat better. Yeah. yeah. Got a theme going on here. Yeah. 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 Diet. Diet. Mine's probably to worry less. Yeah. Explore more. Yeah. Mm. Be reckless. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Just I'll, just drive a catamaran. Yeah. <laughs> So I could tell you where so to around go. town. Really? The old reviews. <laughs> oh yes. Yeah. So, uh, coming back with to the that. Uh, I feel like Hitler with his hair, do you? Well, feel I, like him or not like him? Slants to the side. Yeah. <laughs> just a man. <laughs> <laughs> I've got so much hate. Just, just, <laughs> yeah, yeah. just hate a specific group for some reason. It's uh, so like granddad. White guys, yeah. It's yeah. a whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he was an unsavory character. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I didn't like him. Did at not all. like him at all. I was uncomfortable. I enjoyed him. Yeah. I thought he was one of the nicer characters. <laughs> Sorry, that improv. Thank you very much for watching this podcast. I hope you don't regret it. <laughs> Depends on how it turns out. In the yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've been joined by David Reese. Thank you. Thank you. What your name? Hello, David. Future self watching this. You won't make it to this far in the video. <laughs> <laughs> Just skips to the end. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Max Smith. Yeah, get Yay! fucked. <laughs> Yeah, that was another episode done and dusted, yeah? On to the next one, motherfucker. Yeah, I don't even care. <laughs> Woo! He's got his grandma's blouse on underneath. <laughs> <laughs> and Tom Looney. Thanks, Looney. everyone. Looney. Uh, Looney. 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 Always great to take part in the Stephen Tries podcast. Yes, uh, yeah, yeah. It's highlight of the week in many ways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Joe McGrath. Boom. Sorry. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Uh, Joe, tell us about the podcast you've been working on. I've got a new podcast all about football. 
Uh, hopefully you guys be, can join it'll us. It'll be linked yeah. below. Love to. Steve's joining us. Tom's joining us in the future for it. I've got so much um, football knowledge. We've got to yeah, chat. Yeah, great much. footballers. Uh, yeah. Please subscribe or otherwise I'll get fired. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Stay safe. Stay humble. Ciao.